the best feature for me was how it fit into my life where I could still continue to have my uh, uh, professional life and work in the clinic full time, um, take maybe a day off every few months in order to take a course and, and go for the weekend course, but most of it was done at home. So I think uh, the way it fit into my lifestyle was great. The option of going to a weekend type class format, which is a Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Usually they're pretty intense, um, as can be expected. There's pre-course work prior to um, attending the, the class. There's also an online type format, um, which could be also intense. But when the class actually meets on campus, you have that one-on-one uh, -on -one interaction time where you can immediately in, um, have access to the, the professor or the uh, instructor for that course and be able to get immediate answers to the questions as they come to you. But I think that the access that you have over a, a Friday, Saturday, Sunday with those professors is kind of invaluable. Continuing education is very important. It keeps me abreast of the newest advances and being able to integrate that information into my practice so I can better myself, so I can make my patients' lives a lot better. I'm being more efficient in how I'm delivering my care, so I'm not Killing healthcare dollars, education is key. Folks that are fresh out of school can continue that scholarly pursuit. Um, folks that have uh, been out for a short time can further their, their uh, understanding and, and knowledge base. And then folks that have been out of the academic setting for a long time, um, it, it certainly tailors to them, uh, allows them to uh, get in touch with research and get in touch with uh, uh, what's happening in physical therapy. They've have the opportunity to draw from a wide assortment of instructors that are masters in their fields. So it's nice, it's very nice. I think that's one of the strengths that it has is, is that one-on-one -on -one interaction um, that they have for the post-professional program and the ability to tailor to your needs uh, as a therapist. Uh, we've had folks from all across the country that serve as adjunct faculty that um, manage their courses from afar come in for the weekend course where you have one-on-one -on -one access to them um, and to the latest and greatest um, in the field, the cutting edge stuff as far as research goes in physical therapy. Being able to learn from my classmates that have come from different cultures, different regions of the nation um, is really nice. And seeing what's done on the West Coast as compared to the East Coast. One of the other aspects of the program is that it does offer you a chance to sort of have a minor in, in certain areas. So, um, for instance, you can have a minor in administration or a minor in education or geriatrics along those lines to where you can basically customize your program, um, orthopedics, neurological, uh, whatever your clinical practice focuses on, you can also focus your academic studies on. I would definitely recommend UND's post-professional program for any student or anyone considering going back to school. If you're thinking of it, I say investigate it fully. Speak with others that have gone through the program. Um, get their ideas. Audit a couple classes to see if that's what you want. I think everybody has an evolving practice in physical therapy where they're trying different things at, at different times, but um, keeping in touch with the research and the evidence out there, uh, which is what the post-professional program lends itself to, I think um, hopefully more rapidly evolves how I practice and makes me a more effective therapist.